Oh, hey, what's going on, guys? I haven't seen you in a cool minute. How's it going? How you guys doing? You know, while you guys are here, I'm gonna teach you guys something. Today, guys, we're gonna be going over uh, five outfits for teen men. And this is five kind of unique items, or not five unique items. These are five unique outfits that any guy can wear and he'd still pop off. Now, some of these shoes are that I have. Watch, come on, come on, come on. Come on follow me, you guys. This is some MTV Cribs, right? So look. I have not that much clothing, like I have a lot of champion, kind of like just basic stuff, right? I have NASA, NASA. I have this when I went to a dance once. Um, yeah. But um, as you can see, like I have, I don't have that much clothing, you know what I mean? <laughs> you might think, oh, Michael, where's your pants? Like, look, if you look at all my clothing, like it's right here. I'm not, I'm not made of money, guys, but like, I do save money, you know? But like, here, here, here's all my unique clothing. I like That's, that's my, that's my clothes section right there. That's my clothes section. These are my pants. These are my pants right here. All right, these are all my pants. Now I'm gonna show you guys five unique items, or not few unique, few unique items, but unique clothing. And uh, all I can ask guys, I just wanna emphasize this part real quick. If you guys do go on to enjoy this part, or, or this video, please drop a like, subscribe if you guys are new, and honestly, just please support this, promote it, do whatever. I want this video to go viral and really show people. You don't have to have a lot of money to prove you're cool, okay? I'm not made of money. I'm, I'm a big believer in buying clothes that are cheap. You know what I mean? Like, it's just basically buying clothes that are cheap and reliable. I know some people can be like, well, more the more expensive the clothes is, the more... Uh, you know, it'll last you longer. That is completely false, okay? That is just bogus. I've had some of these pair of pants for like a couple years now, and I still wear them to this day. Look at, look at this, this is like, I'm wearing skinny jeans. I've had them for like a year and a half now. They're still reliable, all right? Now, um, here are my pair of shoes. I haven't I haven't really seen these people. I have a white pair of Vans that are pretty dirty. Uh, I, I, I like to, when I like to like, dance sometimes like a Mexican uncle. You know what I mean? I'm just I have two pairs of checker boots, uh, my Air Force ones, I don't really take care of them as much more. My pair of Vans, I usually wear on the daily now. Um, my other Vans, my other Vans, and um, my sandals are here. I'm looking like a Mexican dad here. No, I'm sorry. But um, other than that, guys, yeah, that, I just want, please, 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 don't ever spend like thousands of dollars on some stupid clothes. But um, other than that, guys, I'll see you guys right outside right now. I'm going to show you guys. Actually, let's, let's go right now. Alright guys, so for this first outfit, I'm already wearing it, and it's basically just me wearing a white shirt, literally just a white shirt, I got an H&M, pretty cheap price, and um, this shirt I got at um, Marshalls, Marshall, this, this shirt was like 8 bucks, now I don't like how it does like this, like, I'm not a really big fan of it, so I rolled the sleeves like this, and then boom, that's, that makes the thing 100% much better, okay, just rolling up my sleeves make the shirt pop, alright, remember guys, you want to do things that make your vision of your outfit really creative okay you just want to make something that you're comfortable with and that's really really affordable all right so first things first i'm probably going to be using these a lot but my um uh, my white vans actually they're pretty dirty but i got them at the beginning of uh, i want to say august so yeah okay so pa pair of pants like i'm wearing skinny jeans so everybody says skinny jeans are out of the trend but that is a complete lie skinny jeans are in the trend right? now for me i like to like I like to roll up my sleeves sometimes. It looks a little bit professional, like it makes you look a little better, you know? Um, but if you don't want to, that's perfectly understandable, you know? I like it, and um, I just feel like it's comfortable. I'm not wearing a belt right now, because I don't want to, but there's a lot of unique things you can make that make your outfit look better. First things first, I just want to clarify, you don't have to spend thousands upon thousands of dollars to look good. Like, let's be honest, I'm looking okay right now. Guys, this is my first outfit. Remember, it's just a buttoned up shirt, with the white shirt or just any shirt that's white or can match with the, the color of your button up shirt or you can just button it up as it is right so let me show you guys tell me a breath you could also roll up the shirt which makes it a little better you know don't roll up the sleeves. If you don't want to be rolling sleeves, that's perfectly understandable. Now, one thing that I don't really recommend, but if you really are into it, then button up the last part of the shirt. Now, one thing other other than that, there's one more thing. I like to tuck in my shirt sometimes, but if you don't like to, that's perfectly understandable. 
don't force yourself to do something that you don't like to remember that um but yeah this is my first outfit i don't know if you guys like it but i'm just giving you guys the image and you guys can remember you guys can change anything about this outfit if you guys want now if you guys like what you're enjoying let's move on to outfit two I'm wearing, uh, I have my, my sleeves rolled up on my shoes, but um, I'm wearing uh, checkerboard bands because I think they match and they fit the style. I'm wearing the same pants, um, just uh, I got this at Marshall's, the sweater, I really like it because it has like some Polaroid, kind of like some old kind of vibes, and I'm wearing my flannel. Every guy has to have a flannel, man. It's, it just, it, it'll be good in your wardrobe, and not only that, but red flannels are heat. Always match, they are heat. Um, nothing really too crazy about this. But yeah, like, I really like this. I have a bracelet on. I, I think it's called the Radisclat. I really like the bracelet because it does pop. I made mine smaller um, by washing it, so shrinking it, sort of. Um, I really like it. It does go good with it. For my glasses, I nothing else besides that. Again, remember, you guys can change anything. Wear black pants if you want. Um, I really don't recommend it. But wear white pants, yellow pants, khakis. Khakis go good with this. Um, just other things. I'll give you some... Uh, other shoes, you can go with your white bands. Um, I know some people like to go with uh, um, dad shorts. Dad shorts, you can go with these too. Uh, khaki pants, khaki shorts look good. Um, you have to find the right pair though. But uh, yeah, this outfit is not too crazy. Uh, we're gonna dive into some better ones. Uh, the third one, the third outfit is going to be a little pricey and I will get into that. Um, but yeah, this is the outfit. I hope you guys enjoy this video so far. If you guys are, remember, drop a like. It really does help, help me out. And it lets me know you guys want more videos like this. So, yeah, but uh, again, white checkerboard bands, um, or checkerboard bands, bracelet, radish clock, I think that's what it's called. Uh, same pants, uh, skinny jeans, my Polaroid sweater, and then a flannel. Um, there's other types of flannels you guys can get. Yellow one, I have a, I have a bunch. Uh, I'll put on pictures on the screen of some pictures that I have. If not, then probably not. But I have a yellow one, I have a white one, I have a blue one. I have quite a bit, but um, I prefer the red one, always because it looks the most stylish. And um, guys, again, these outfits are just to and just to like show you guys that you can make anything out of anything. Like literally, I'm wearing the same thing and I still look like good. Right, well, if that, in, if you guys like more, let's continue. Alright guys, so the next form of outfit that I really do want to emphasize, by the way I have a ring on because I feel like rings go great with this kind of style, but let me get into that. Alright, so the first thing I have on is the ring. That is a big part of this kind of outfit that I do want. Now the next one is the turtleneck. Turtlenecks are starting to make a big comeback. Uh, they really are. Um, quite a, I see a different forms of turtlenecks. I bought this one for $3 at Paxson. It was really, really cheap and I really like it. And um, this was 40 something dollars on, I think it was uh, Forever 21. It was Forever 21. I got these at Walmart. The khakis look nice. I got these at Bass Pro Shop or something like that. It's um, in Gilroy, California, if you guys know that type. Um, but secondly, I really like this outfit because it was pretty, it's around what? Um, I want to say under like 100 bucks. Actually, no, it's like $150 because of the pants, or not the pants, but the shoes. And this, the flat, the turtleneck was pretty cheap and is very itchy. Now, when it's a cold, pretty cold day, you can be walking around like this, you know, just minding your own business and just enjoying your time, you know? I really do like this outfit because it's kind of casual and just it's whatever. It's not like a big old eye opener. Now, a cool thing about this is if you want, you can tuck in the, 
Well, I guess you can say the turtleneck you can tuck it in but i prefer to just keep it like this because i feel like it looks better now um this is the third out third out <laughs> um i really do like this again my chukka boots were around i want to say 80 or 90 bucks these were pretty good i they're just very comfortable do not if you buy these do not have water around them because they will stain them and i still have not gotten that steamer remover thing which i really do need to invest and get um i'm wearing a bracelet but i don't really recommend the bracelet because you're not going to be able to show it too much on the outfit but um yeah guys that's pretty much for this outfit this is like the fancy part of this video this is like the very fancy type outfit now if you guys do enjoy more let's get to the fourth one guys yeah, so for this one um i'm wearing a ring again because i just want my outfit to look as mediocre as possible i want it to just be me you know i'm this is my emphasis on streetwear so as you guys can see i'm not wearing some striped pants or anything i do have like pants with designs on them but i don't like to wear them um with these kind of outfits. so i'm just wearing a pink uh, shirt uh i like the back of it it's a freaking huff shirt uh, i have a champion um jacket it's jacket i have my uh my hat on and i have my air force ones honestly just a normal, typical outfit I would normally not wear. I don't wear this kind of stuff anymore as much, but I do like to wear it time to time. Um, but again, there's people who like to roll up their sleeves and all that. But um, look, 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 at this. look at this. Zoom in on here. Zoom in. Zoom in. Oh, crap. Go from the bottom to the top. Look at this. Look at me. I'm dripping. I'm dripping in all the season. And then, boom. Again, you guys don't have to wear hats, but I typically wear a hat, something that matches with it. I personally do like to wear hats, but I can't wear it to the school I wear. I go to because of stupid reasons. But um, if you want to button it up, button it up, be my guest. But uh, this is just a normal streetwear kind of shirt. Because I feel like the shirt, black part, the faded kind of black part, they all, it all matches with this. And I personally really, really do dig it. And I really do like it. But um, nothing too much to say. You can also like put on a bracelet. Uh, I already wore my black one just to show you guys. But I can show you guys my white one. I do like my white um, bracelet, so I do like it. I would kind of match. I would kind of like to wear it like this. I would wear the black one, but just to show things, show that I can just match things differently, just kind of go with this. So uh, this is the fourth and outfit. The fifth one isn't something super serious, and you guys really might not like it, but I think it's a thing that not a lot of people like to wear anymore. Now remember this guys, these are my opinions on the kind of clothes that I wear. Please respect it and I respect you. Um, other than that, oh, let's get into the final fifth outfit. All right guys, so the final outfit can vary in different ways. So not, I don't, I want to emphasize this one in different ways. This is a Nev shirt. I've had it for like, since my sophomore year. Um, I have my long socks on and I have um, my Vans that I normally wear. I don't wear a lot of shorts because typically I'm not a very short guy. Um, but uh, hold on right there. All right, so the last one is socks and sandals, shorts, and a shirt. Now this one, guys, I wear to school all the time, and how the people wear socks and sandals. Listen, this is where I'm talking about my opinions. So for starters, guys, you don't have to be the best looking guy out there. Just dress, because when you dress, you get your opinions out there. I hope you guys know that. Like, you give signs out there. You give like what you think out there to people. You know, clothing does give a more sense of morality to people. And not a lot of people take that into consideration, you know? Like, if you dress good, and if you do good things, like, like I'm, not, I'm not dressed perfectly, but, you know, if you dress good, like, like just for instance, I'm not flexing on you guys. I have AirPods. Again, I'm not flexing, but just for starters, if I'm on the road, and I'm just chilling, and I, I get out, and I'm going to go to, like, the beach or something to read or just hang out, I'm going to dress like this because I'm not trying to go to perfect places, you know? I'm just chilling, relaxing with my socks and sandals. Girls wear sandals all the time, and they look good. And they're wearing a blouse and stuff, and shorts. And I'm not, I'm not judging quality or anything. I'm not getting political with equality. I'm just saying in general though, like if you wear socks and sandals, it's not gonna kill you guys. Just wear them to school once in a while. Just wear, uh, just wear uh, pajamas and a shirt. That's what I would do. I know it looks bummy sometimes, and I do get that feeling. But at the end of the day, guys, it's you. It's just for a day. Like it's not gonna be, it's not gonna kill you. But um, that's it, guys. Um, I'm wearing a different hat. Uh, that's gonna pretty much be it though. 
If you guys did enjoy this video, please be sure to drop a like, subscribe if you guys are new, and I'll catch you guys in the next one. And um, that's pretty much it. But please share this with your friends and everything. Uh, comment. Go follow me on my social medias. I also, I do want to give a big shout out to my friend Alex, the videographer, recording this video. Um, I Big shout out to you, man. But um, other than that, guys, I hope you guys have a good day.